The story of people welcoming Jesus into Jerusalem with palms. As Jesus came closer to Jerusalem, he asked two of his disciples to go ahead of him. He said, when you get to Jerusalem, you will see a donkey tied up, untie it and bring it to me. If anyone asks you about taking the donkey, just say, the Lord needs it and he will bring it back as soon as he's finished with it. So the disciples did as Jesus asked. They soon found the donkey tied at a doorway. As they were untying it, some people were standing nearby visiting. They didn't know the man and asked, what are you doing? Why are you untying the donkey? The men replied just as Jesus had told them to. They explained that the Lord needed it and the people let them take the donkey. When they brought the donkey to Jesus, some of the disciples took off their coats and laid them on the donkey's back. They did this out of respect for Jesus. Then Jesus rode on the donkey towards Jerusalem. As he was traveling, some people saw Jesus coming and came running towards him. They had heard he might be coming and they wanted to see him because he had just helped a dead man come back to life. They were all amazed. One by one, they laid their coats on the ground for the donkey to step on. Even the people who weren't wearing coats ran to the fields and trees nearby and cut palm branches and laid them down. These people knew that Jesus was special. It was like when a king would come to town and people would roll out a red carpet for him to step on. This is what these people did for Jesus when they laid down their coats and branches. They were celebrating Jesus as a king. As they got even closer to the town, more and more people noticed Jesus. A crowd surrounded him and started to shout praises to him for all the miracles he had accomplished. Hosanna! Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord! Hosanna! Hosanna! The word Hosanna means save us. They said this because Jesus was helping them and doing amazing things. They wanted to praise him and they wanted him to keep helping them. After the crowd went home, Jesus and his disciples, his friends, found a place to make supper. They were all getting hungry, so they decided to prepare some food so they could have supper together. What do you think they ate and drank? <laughs>